Welcome to Euron everyone. My name is Dhanshu Kumar and uh, I'm here to make an official announcement about an uh, internship portal that uh, it's free for everyone. Anyone and everyone who would like to like uh, get an internship certificate, whether it's an onboarding one, whether it's a completion one. So yes, if you are doing an internship as per the guidelines that we have given to you, it's freely available to everyone. So maybe you are a fresher, maybe you are uh, someone who is maybe into their last year, maybe doing a BCA, BBA, MCA, or maybe something else. And if you are looking for an internship, if you are looking for a project into a tech domain, after upskilling from anywhere, right? Uh, so obviously this internship portal is completely available to all of you. And you all will be able to generate an official letter as well, which I'm going to show you, which I'm going to demonstrate, which is pretty much easy for all of you. But yeah, first of all, let's try to understand that why we are trying to make it free. Uh, let me share my screen and uh, so that I can show you that part. So here, if you will come on Euron.1, which uh, the link is already attached inside uh, uh, like a description. So you all will be able to find out. So here you will be able to see an internship portal. Now, if you are going to click and if you'll come over here, you will be able to find out a uh, lots of project into a different different domain into a different different technology whether it's a python whether it's a front end whether it's a back end whether it's a big data whether it's a data analytics whether it's a blockchain whether it's a generative ai agentic ai or maybe a data science machine learning just name anything and everything and domain wise so telecommunication, uh, media, security, governance, legal, every in every domain, you will be able to find out the project in all the categories, easy, medium, and hard. Now, so here we have uploaded more than 600 plus project, by the way. Yeah, so 600 plus projects are available just inside this internship portal. And it's a self-serving portal. Now, what was the intention? What was the idea behind creating this entire portal? The idea was very simple that... Uh, Anyone and everyone, right? Anyone and everyone who is looking for an internship. And literally, anyone, when I say anyone, means literally anyone and everyone who is looking for an internship because nowadays internship is a need. And obviously, it's very tough to get an internship in any company nowadays. So what you can do, you can try to like uh, get into this internship portal. You can try to enroll yourself into this internship portal and you can try to select a project as per your need and then you can try to complete it. Now, let me show you how it works. So I'll, I can go here and I can try to select any of this domain or maybe I can try to search for uh, big data, let's suppose, yeah, big data. I will be able to find out a tons of project with respect to a big data. So I can just check the keyword over here. And let's suppose if I'm interested into this project, I can just go and click on view details. And detail wise, we are following the 100% industrial approach. So in an industry, whenever you are going to join some projects, so obviously, uh, people are going to give you a PRD, project requirement document, or you are going to create a PRD, project requirement document. You will be creating a HLD, high level design document and low level design document, LLD. Each project, for every project, you will be able to find out that we have given you a PRD and that too in a very, very detailed way. That what you have to do, what kind of a feature that you have to develop, what kind of a user that you are supposed to target, what should be the core feature, what should be the functional requirement? What should be the non-functional requirement? Everything you will be able to find out here, right? Everything you will be able to find out here. And uh, in an amazing way, we have given you this entire requirement, right? In an entire requirement so that you will be a plus timeline we have given to you that to complete this particular project. So what is the timeline which is required? Now, now the thing is that, that <clears throat> we have given you a detailed requirement we have given you a detailed high level design document. We have given you a detailed low level design document. As you can see for every project means every project and it's different. Data we have not added by the way because data you have to select from some of the open source uh, data set repository. Maybe from a Kegel, maybe from a UCI repository, maybe from a Google data set. But yeah, that, that's something that you can try to pick and choose. Now, so you can try to, if, if, if you're liking this particular project, right? So maybe I can try to click on enroll now. And once I'm going to click on enroll now, it will be visible inside your project dashboard. Simple, right? So if we are going to like uh, click on this enroll project, so you will be able to see that one over here. And again, you can see PRD, HLD, LLD. If you are going to click on continue project, so it is going to generate for the very first time, right? It is going to generate an offer letter for you. So basically it's a onboarding letter for all of you. Now here, 
So you will be able to get onboarding offer later and anyone can verify it. So you can't forge any one of our offer later. It's a genuine letter that you all will be able to generate and anyone by just by clicking on this link or maybe just by scanning the QR code, anyone can verify it or maybe they can try to even send a mail to us saying that, okay, fine. So can you please verify this offer later and we can verify, right? We can verify uh, from our end. Now, so here uh, you can just go and you can start doing a project. Yeah, start doing a project. So we have given you a Kanban style board as well over here, right? Kanban style board and you can try to like move your task. You can try to assign a task to yourself. You can try to assign a task to any one of your team member as well. So you can even try to create a team member. You can just try to click on invite members, right? And a link will be copied. Now once link will be copied, so you can try to share this link with anyone and anyone with this link will be able to join the particular project. As simple as that. So maybe if you are looking for your batchmate to join your project, maybe if you are looking for your colleague to join your project or your teacher, your uh, professor to join this particular project. So yes, they can join, they can see each and every work, they can collaborate and they can contribute. And even they will be able to get the offer later, they will be able to get each and everything that you are getting for this project. Parallelly, so they can start their own separate project and you can try to start your own separate project. So this is how simple this is, by the way. Yeah, you can even enroll into a new project, a multiple one. That's completely fine. And then you have to submit the project. So once you are going to submit the project, so as per the instruction which is given over here. Now we are going to evaluate your project within 12 to 48 hour after submission. And then we are going to give you the final letter. Mentioning that, that you have completed this project from this day to this day. So for this many this much of time you have done this internship with us. Technically, this is something that you all will be able to get apart from this onboarding letter. So onboarding letter by default, you will be able to get, but completion letter you will be able to get when, when our system is going to approve it, when our system is going to check each and everything, and then it is going to basically give you the final letter. So 600 plus project we have already uploaded inside this one. 600 plus project, not just one, not just two, 600 plus project you will be able to find out and that too from a variety of a domain, right? Variety of the domain. So you can try to start some open source projects, some futuristic projects, some startup based projects, some education based projects, some research based projects. There are tons of this, right? There are tons of it. There are like a, so many things that we have already done, so many things we have already created. And again, we are keep on adding the projects as per the need and as per the, you know, uh, request uh, which we used to receive from the student side, basically. So this is how this entire internship portal works and it's completely available. It's completely free to all of you, by the way, right? It's completely free. It's completely available. Many people have already started doing an internship. We have a dedicated internship group as well. And uh, apart from that, so yeah, in a batches, many people have already picked their project. They have already generated the certificate. They have already used the certificate, right? Because I know it's a need. It's a need of an R, obviously, right? So now keeping everything in our mind, it's completely free, completely free to all of you. So hope all of you are going to like it, love it. Apart from that, so you all are going to make use of it as much as you can. Now, this, this was the whole motto. This was the whole idea. This was the whole reason behind creating this internship portal for all of you guys. So with that, uh, thank you so much, everyone. Take care. Euron is with you. Take care, everyone.